I'm going to show you how to generate your own free artificial intelligence voiceovers using Adobe Audition. It's really, really easy. With Adobe Audition opened, you just need to start a new audio file. I've done that already. You just go to File, New, and make sure to select Audio File, and then you can create your own AI voiceover. And this is how to do it. If you go into Effects and you want to look for Generate, this is a bit of a hidden gem. There is a speech option here, and it's really, really good. Here's Daniel, the English UK voice. Let's play him. Hello there. That's pretty cool, isn't it? You can type in anything you like. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. And let's wait for it to generate for a second. And I might need to press play. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. Really, really cool, right? But not only that, we can also change the language. So we could go to French France and we type in bonjour and I'm sure it'll work in any language, which is the coolest thing about this feature. Let's play this. You are the weakest. Bonjour. He was almost saying the English accent there, wasn't he? Bonjour. Bonjour. So that's absolutely fantastic. And if we go to English United States, the Mike Russell podcast, and it takes a little while to generate, so you'll notice that it doesn't quickly generate. It needs to run it through its neural network or whatever it's using to make that speech, and then we can hit play on this, and it should... The Mike Russell podcast. It should make our own voiceover, which is cool. We've got Alex, who's a male from the US, but I really like Fred because he sounds kind of like a little bit robotic. The Mike Russell podcast. That's really cool, isn't the it? The Mike Russell podcast. And of course, we can change genders as well. So we could go female here. we got Samantha here, ready to read my name. The Mike Russell podcast. That sounds awesome. Or we can change from Samantha to Victoria and listen to how she sounds. The Mike Russell podcast. And if we want, we can also turn the speaking rate up so it goes really mega fast. The Mike Russell podcast. Or really mega slow by turning the speaking rate down. The Mike Russell podcast. So as you can hear, lots of customization inside this AI tool. And by the way, if you want to play further, click settings here. It's going to take you into, well, certainly on a Mac, it'll take you to the accessibility controls where you can find all the voices here, customize them, even make sure you tick to upgrade the enhanced quality version, and then you get an even better AI voice. If you're on a PC, you'll be using the Windows text-to-speech. And depending where you are and what text-to-speech plugins you've got installed on your computer, it should give you access right right here in Audition to, as you can see, quite a wide range of languages and different voice actors as well. So while it's not quite replacing the humble and brilliant voice actor, it certainly will get you a quick voiceover in a pinch right inside Adobe Audition using AI text-to-speech generated voiceovers. Let me know how you get on with this effect in the comments down below. And if you're really enjoying this, you probably want to know my three favorite effects for voiceovers. And that's in the video that's on your screen right now. Go and watch it.